Have you ever been using index match in Google Sheets but need to match more than one row or column? So in today's video, I'm going to show you how to do just that. So let's jump in and start our index match formula. And so we're going to start with our wrapper, which is our index, and select the numbers that we want to return. And then we're going to use our match to find our row and our column. So basically what we're doing is we have this table here. And so we can refer to it as row one, row two, row three, and so forth, and column one, two, three, four. And so what our match formula does is it returns a number. And so if I select north here, for example, and then search in my region, now north is repeated, but the way match works is going to return the first one. And so if we hover over this, you can see it's returning row one. And then if I repeat this for our column, and then I'm gonna pick actual here, and then let's go ahead and select here. And again, zero for exact match. And so at this point, we're gonna turn 7718, which is here. So it found the first north, first actual, and then it ironed in on this one. Now the issue with this method is it doesn't allow us to use our revenue in our category as well. However, we can accomplish this with a simple hack. And so let's go back into our match. So basically what we need to do is match both north and residential. And so we can actually do this with what's called concatenation. And so we can combine two things. And so let me just do this real quick. If we do equals north and residential, you can see it comes together as one piece of text. So that works great on this side, but on this side, we need to somehow combine north and residential, south and residential, and so forth. Now, that's actually easier than you might think, and it's using what's called an array literal. And so array literal, we wrap with these curly braces, and then we can combine two ranges. And so I'm just going to copy this, and I'm going to use ampersand, paste, and then we're going to use D. And what this is going to do is it's going to combine those. So let me go ahead and just put this in here. And you can see that combined this. Now, and this one is going to turn it into an array. And so an array would be like this. And so now it's doing the whole thing. And so now you can see if we combine these and combine these, we're now actually going to do a match. And so now let's just do the other one here. So we got K6 and k7 and then we can just combine these as well so curly brace open curly brace close and then we're going to do the same thing here copy this ampersand and this time it's going down a row not across and so now we do 7718 and so that's north residential actual revenue so at this point it looks like the same but now if we go to expenses for example it goes to 3627 if we change this to budget, now it's 4244. So we have North Residential, Budget Expenses, and there we go. So now if we drop this to West, for example, we have 6657. So West Residential, and then over here, 6657. And that is how you can use index match with multiple criteria on both rows and columns. And so if you only had this on one side, for example, you could use the combined version here and then a simple version on the other side, and it worked just fine. Or you can use both if you need to match multiple on both. And you could even use this for more than two as well. If you had three, you would just do another ampersand and another option, and then you'd do another ampersand here and add another option there as well. All right, so that is it for today's video. Make sure to check out the other videos on our channel for more tutorials on both Google Sheets and AppScript. And as always, have a great day.